Okay guys, so peek this. Two suspects believed to be responsible for the 2002 murder of Jam Master J were arrested and indicted on Monday, August 17th. It didn't take long for internet sleuths to discover the Instagram account of Carl Jordan Jr., one of the Run DMC Legends alleged killers. One quick glance in its apparent Jordan's account is peppered with numerous tribute posts to the late hip hop legend, stretching back to at least 2012. His most recent post was on January 21st of this year when he pinned a birthday tribute to JMJ. Happy birthday, OG, he wrote in the caption. So many stories, so many memories. I remember when we was in the Land Cruiser coming from McDonald's and you was playing Killing Me Softly, Lauren Hill joint. If we knew the words, we got $50. We all knew the words. You gave us all $50 each. Love you and miss you. We gotta protect the good. RIP JMJ. Acting U.S. Attorney for the Eastern District of New York, Seth Ducharme, announced a grand jury had returned an incitement on Monday afternoon alleging Ronald Washington and Jordan were responsible for the slaying inside JMJ's Jamaica Queen studio on October 30th, 2002. They shot him in cold blood, Ducharme said in part. Our office, along with our federal partners and the NYPD, started working that case in the early 2000s, very soon after the murder and there were a lot of challenges that we faced right away. In fact, one of the first cases that I worked on when I was here as a prosecutor in 2008 was this very case. These gentlemen and our team were able to accomplish what I was frankly not then able to accomplish. Unsurprisingly, Jordan's posts were soon littered with angry comments that ranged from you're a sick person and you have to be the grimiest ever bruh rest in hell and rot to 100% psychopath and this is foul. You murdered him and continue with the shenanigans. But what do you guys think? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to hiphopdx.com.